Okay. Um, okay. At the end of the previous part, uh, I have uh, described about the VOC. VOC, yeah. So the term OC is actually uh, refer to the open circuit or unloaded voltage. So again, I, I wrote here, I write here, OC is open circuit. Circuit. So here you see this the output port. There is no no RL connected. So the V out, although we have the Z out here, so the V out will should be equal to A V O C V in. So because the current is zero, and here the voltage is zero. So no voltage drop. So the output will be equal to the what produced by this AC source. Okay, here V out is equal to A V O C V in. And then if the resistance here, the internal resistance is zero, so the V in is equal to V S. Okay, this is unloaded voltage gain. Okay, we have the loading effect at the input. So the loading effect uh, occurs due to the internal resist uh, due to the internal resistance of the source. So the amplifier input voltage V in will be less than V S because the voltage division between R S and Z I. So this is uh, we have uh, derived this one as the V in again. Make sure that you can differentiate differentiate between V I and V S. V S is the one that uh, the the one uh, the parameters the supply voltage, and then the V in is the actual voltage value being uh, inserted or being applied to the uh, to the amplifier. Okay, so uh, this is V in, and then you know V out. V out is equal to A V O C V in. Because there is no voltage drop at Z out, so and then V in by using this the first equation, you can get this Z i over R s plus Z i V s. So lastly, you can define a gain denote as a A V s. So A V s, what is A V s? Is a V out with respect to the signal voltage V s. So you can get A V o c times Z i over R s plus Z i. So the gain, the gain of the amplifier will depend on your definition. So whether you define the gain, so we have many definition of the gain. Let's say if the gain is A V is equal to V out over V in, or it can be V out over V s. So it's many possible for the gain. So make sure you uh, know. What is the definition of the gain that you want to analyze before you do the analysis? Uh, at the output output uh, part, if you connect with the RL, so the V out will be you can use the voltage divider and you can get the V out. This is uh, we have done the derivation in the previous part, and then we know the AV is if the AV is V out over V in okay, here. AV is V out over V in. So you the AV is defined by this uh, equation. If the AV is V out over V S, you can get this equation. Okay, so you you see this uh, the, the total gain here AV S. We'll need to consider we'll consider the uh, voltage drop at the output and voltage drop at the input. Okay. If uh, you want to, you have the voltage amplifier model, and you want to uh, calculate or analyze the current gain. Okay, so the current gain, you can uh, can uh, analyze the current gain using a very simple uh, circuit analysis method. So I out is a V or C V in over Z R Z out plus R L. So this is a uh, Ohm's law. O K V L. K V L along this uh, loop. So we can get I out is equal A V or C V in over Z out plus R L. So and then the V in. What is the V in? V in is I in times Z in. So this is Ohm's law. 
So now you get the i out as a function of i in. So because uh, here the first equation as a function of v in, and then next we define the v in as a function of i in, and then lastly, if you combine the first and the second equation, you can get i out as a function of i in. So i out as a function of i in, you can uh, analyze the current current gain, which is let's say this is i out over i in. Okay, this is the current gain, and then next uh, the in the in input current is the current at the input port. So this is uh, slightly uh, uh, lower than the actual current source current. So using the uh, current divider, I in is equal to RS over RS plus ZI. So lastly, you can get AIS. So AIS, consider uh, this is uh, at the input part, input part and then this is at the output. Okay, this slide summarize all the relevant equation so my suggestion no need to uh, to, re to memorize all of this equation as long as you can uh, do the analysis using the voltage divider so the important is voltage divider and then current divider current divided equation okay so this is uh, these are two important equation uh, that you need to master you need to master and be able to use and then uh, beside of the equation make sure you you know what is v in what is the difference between v in and vs and what is i in what is i out what is is so this is also important